guys, just thought I'd make an update video. I haven't done one of these in a couple years. Um, this is my new to me uh, 2011 328i. So the M52 motor again, uh, it is the LCI, my first LCI, and actually my first true N52. My last C92 was an N51 actually. So um, the car is completely stock. Uh, internally I've done some cosmetic stuff that I'll show you right now um, starting off it is a um, M Sport kit so you've got the style 193s you've got the front bumper um, nice side skirts and of course the rear diffuser um, of course it looks a little bit different but I'll get to that in a bit um, it's got about 70,000 miles right now and it is a single hump so no LC, uh, no uh, I drive, but it doesn't really matter. Um, so starting off in the front, I've got the uh, just the OE headlights. Um, they're just on the daytime running headlights, and then I got the actually OE front grills as well. I just sprayed them gloss black. I used to have a front plate on it, obviously, and the last owner probably ran into something with the front plate, so we got that line on there. I'm working on getting that fixed right now. Other than that in the front, I have a cheap AliExpress front lip. Um, I'm not gonna put this link anywhere because I don't recommend buying it for anybody. Um, it said 2011 to 2013, which is the LCI model, um, but it is the pre-LCI one, so it doesn't fit. So I chopped it up and wrapped it in carbon fiber and installed it anyway. So slaps on everything but I don't recommend buying it um, moving along I got the painted um, titanium silver side markers I never did this on my last car always told myself I would really glad I have these um, the style 193s have just been sprayed in a gloss black um, I just did that myself I don't know it looks fine to me uh, on the side I have just like homemade Home Depot side skirts the uh, material itself from Home Depot is probably about 10 or 13 bucks, 10 to 13 bucks. And then the carbon fiber wrap from Amazon was like uh, 20 bucks for everything. I th think it looks okay from afar, just don't get it too close to it. Um, on the side we got, I don't know the percentage, 15% uh, wrap over 35% wrap, so probably like five percent um, and then we got a flat black banner up on the top and a gloss black roof a carbon fiber shark fin and then a little bit further again some more Home Depot stuff uh, I just made these fins or whatever these are called um, cut them and then wrapped them in the same carbon fiber I think they look okay for being three or four bucks Heading to the back, we have the OEM carbon lip. Never had one of these either, so the fitment is like amazing, which I've never had before. I've always had like Amazon ones. Um, bought the car with that. That's the only thing that came on the car. I'm really glad that happened. That was on there because I don't want to spend money on that. It's like 400 bucks. Uh, in the back, I bought the OEM diffuser off of somebody. So it's the OEM paint. Last one I had was like a different black so people could tell it wasn't OEM M Sport, which it wasn't. This is OEM M Sport, um, it's just not mine. Uh, and then I replaced it with same exact tips I had on my last car, painted with a gloss black. Not a huge fan of it right now, I don't know why. Um, other than that, that's pretty much the car. It is probably 10% louder than my last car. Maybe five, 10% louder. It idles just the same and sounds pretty much the same at low RPMs, but as you get a little bit higher, it gets raspier because I think I have something done with the primaries, I don't know. Previous owner must have done something. Um, and last but not least, a little overlay vinyl of the BMW logo. I don't know why I like those things. Black too. I guess I'm just going for all silver and black. I forgot to mention this is titanium silver. Um, but this is my 2011 328. I'll give an update.
update if I ever do anything more to it, but for now, I'm happy with how it sits. And I'll, uh, I'll throw up a picture as well of when I bought the car so you can see it stock. So just look out for the picture. I promise I'll throw it up this time. Thanks, guys.